Hey Chapel family, Pastor Kent here. In our ongoing um, moment of prayer video series that we've been doing, uh, Pastor Corey asked me to pray for our first responders, those men and women who serve in law enforcement and fire protection and as EMTs. You know, their, their jobs are, are difficult enough under normal circumstances, but now with the coronavirus, COVID-19 pandemic that's spreading across our country and around the world, um, their jobs are even harder. And so we want to take a moment and, and pray for them today. So would you join me? Heavenly Father, we are thankful uh, for the first responders we have in our community and across our state, country, in the world. Um, Father, they're the ones that run toward the danger. They run into the fire. Um, they jump into the, the middle of, of, of medical emergencies and, and use their skills to save people's lives. And we are thankful for them today. Uh, we ask that uh, you would protect them, both from the dangers of the job and from this extra concern of the coronavirus that's, that's spreading so quickly. Um, I pray that they would have adequate uh, PPE, the personal protective equipment, the, the, the gloves, the masks, and other pieces of equipment that they use um, as they do their jobs. pray that that wouldn't be a concern for them, uh, that they would uh, just have access. We think, too, uh, of their families. Pray that you would safeguard their families from the virus as their loved ones uh, go to work, serve in the community, and then they come home. Um, pray that that virus would not be uh, transmitted to their families. Uh, give their families a sense of peace as well uh, as their loved ones go and serve um, and come back home. I pray, too, that uh, the need for first responders would be minimized during this time of shelter in place and, and, and with the pandemic that's spreading. Uh, just to pray that, the, that folks would shelter in place, that they would not be out and about, that uh, there would be less need for um, those that, uh, that serve in that way. Again, Father, we're thankful for the trained professionals that put themselves in harm's way to help others in dire need. And so we ask you simply protect them as they continue to serve. We pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks for praying with me, Chapel family. Be safe.